All right, everybody, welcome back to our Baldur's Gate 3 Let's Play. I just spent probably about like the last hour and a half replaying this fight just because I recorded 30 minutes past this point. Um, trying to not talk to Minsk and then we were running into some video errors and so I had to scrap that 30 minute video. Then I came back and did this fight again and then I forgot to change to a disguise and then I had to go back and do the fight again. But this time I made a save file, so <laughs> so don't worry about it. Um, now we can talk to Minsk. It's all good. Let's just get right back into it. And sorry for the abrupt cut in the last episode. I was running into some encoding errors, but I, I fixed the issue. The corpse regards you lifelessly. God, her looks pretty nice as a drow. What is your real name, Stone Lord? Minsk of Rashima. What did you want in the counting house? Zeldaran precious treasure. You are paying the Zentarum? What for? Kill nine fingers. Seize Guild Hall. Did you have anything of value worth taking? Boo. 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 This rat. I don't know where we can talk to his rat now, now that we've talked to him. Shadowheart needs to speak to her more than I do. Better wait until she is free. Shadowheart needs to talk to the... the rodent. Looking ahead. I wonder, I don't know, we just like long rest here. Still breathing, despite everything. Not really sure how to talk to that animal. A rat. Or mouse. I think it's a mouse. Our dailies just get longer and longer. I woke up this morning and I was like, I was like actually freezing. So I looked up the freaking temperature and it was, we had a cold front. It was nuts. I mean, I'm in the south, so maybe it's not cold for you guys, but I had to wear, um, I had to, I had to put on some long pants this morning. Still wearing a t-shirt, but I'm technically also wearing a bathrobe. So, you know, cold enough for that. But I don't want to hear from you more than nurse about it not being cold now. <laughs> I think I messed up there. Okay. Not really. Okay, so that was our free cast. Gale. In my endeavors, I also found out that Gale has another ability, which is called Dance Macabre. I think this is from doing the Necromancy quest line. 
I think I've those are all the ladies. Ladies. Like it. See if we can talk to uh, hmm. the thing now. Let's move. How much Maybe not. Can I go? Well. All right. Well, let's uh, let's go ahead and get out of here. So we shall go back to the bank. I'm pretty sure that this this path is probably faster. Yeah. Oh no, it's not. We'll go past this probably the fastest way to get over to Mountain House. Actually, I really don't think it was faster. Standard procedure. Gortas just wants to make sure. <laughs> Alright. Well, while they walk over there... I guess we'll take in this beautiful scenery of the game from the bird's eye view. I'm going to ask for directions. No, no, you mustn't. The city is full of criminals. We can't come back on one side by the side. It really is so beautiful. Here yet? More than simple craft. It's a way of life for some of them. You know, this game it has really impressed me and I think a lot of other people in the gaming community. Um, was that a joke? <laughs> Only if you found it funny. What is this? Fireworks. A particularly nomous field of art, no? Indeed, more than simple craft is a way of life for some. That may explain why most gnomes possess sort of sort pieces. <laughs> I get it. Something caught your eye then? Very Fire funny, Lazel. Most of my wares can take an eye right out. <laughs> Give me your money, boy. Don some armor, then learn to swing a sword. See? All right. I forgot to tell you guys, because I said it in one of the other recordings, so I forgot to repeat it. Since I already said it. Um, but what I was saying in another recording to y'all was that I may have to forego the daily uploads for now just for a little bit because I I was looking for a bunch of games to to fill to fill to play while I was doing my RPG fatigue and so I downloaded a bunch of games and you know you guys know like games nowadays are are pretty big and so I downloaded maybe one or two or three or four too many that were very large. And I found out that my internet provider does have a data cap. It's like 1.2 uh, K gigabytes. So 1.2 terabytes of data, which is a lot. It's like way more than anyone will possibly need. Except that in one day I downloaded about like 400, 500 gigabytes of games. And so that ended up using like half of my data plan. And so right now we have 14 days left of my data plan and we only have, um, you know, 
a hundred a hundred or two hundred gigs left of data and so I might have to forego the daily uploads just for the next like maybe 14 days you know hopefully I can still upload I will still try to download but if I see my usage going up then I will probably um, you know stop stop uploading but I'll still be recording in the background and the daily uploads will continue once the once the next data cycle begins so thank you for your understanding for that and understanding of my like silliness don't don't install 500 gigs of games in one day have you seen what she's doing counting gold in front of a beggar it's like eating bread in front of a starving child We have like 50,000 gold right now. We're over a handful. Thank you, sir. At least some people in this world know kindness. Oh, if you give them money, you just encourage them. She's only going to spend it on ale. What? Hey, man, you never know what's going on in people's lives. Doesn't mean you need to always help them. But at least you can empathize with them. Even though empathy doesn't really go that far. Sometimes. That's the first step. Let's see what this does. I don't understand why we have to go all the way down here. He couldn't have been up in his office at all. The banker. Could go through two instances. Our characters don't take stairs like normal people. Oh, I hope you've come to make a lodgement. A city sized one. Here's the coin that was taken 10,000. And not even a whisker light. Gods, you're a boring bastard. Me too, I suppose, because I'm not even tempted to scam you. Take this vault key. You'll find something by way of thanks inside. 2549. That is a lot of stinking money. have this bag of people's brains in it. I like how it makes a sound when you pick it up. Gale is really the scroll holder of scrolls that we will never use. see here like so heavy uh give some to gale we'll give him like four thousand sixty three and we still look like we're holding like as much as lazelle stuff is hard or it's heavy i don't mean hard Well, we have 41,000 still. Um, the vault that, that opens with that key that he gave us, it opens up this vault. And we already looted it. <laughs> we already took what's inside of it. I already forgot what's inside of it. I'm pretty sure it was like pretty much useless for us. So now we have to go back to Guild Vault. It was down here somewhere. Pretty sure. Need to walk a little bit further. Right there. Where the guild entrance is. So yeah, I actually in the first recording that I was doing, I went through the the bank. And then I went over here to to the guild hall all the way there. And that took me quite a while. <clears throat> I 
And we were running into this issue where there are like black squares like glitching on the screen. And I wasn't really satisfied with that, so I just decided to like just like screw it, I'm just gonna reshoot the whole thing. And now I'm like uh ner uh, I'm not nervous, uh, I'm like anxious, so now I'm like making more saves than usual. Do not worry. Guild's friends are Taskrunt's friends. And I don't hurt my friends. Unless they deserve it. Okay, Taskrunt. Go inside. Resolve the guild hall conflict. We return to find the guild hall at war. Zentarum face off against guild, hoping to topple Nine Fingers Keen. Hold it there! Bad time to come a visiting, my friend. This is Zentarum territory now. Just as soon as we've purged it of guild rats. Nothing personal. Oh, right into battle. I thought I killed them. I thought that we killed like that one spy. I guess they know where the guild hall is. What the? Okay. Person's pretty weak. I wonder if we can kill her with a normal shot. Just barely, but we did it. Why are you just carrying this around? These monks are insane. Lazelle's initiative is trash. I can't like she's like all the way in the back. It takes like forever, forever for her to do anything. Um Trying to think here. I kinda wanna just like clear out everything. These guys have 82 HP, 76 HP. These guys on the bottom are pretty tanky. What if go down here? I can bless these people. that hmm. what if we just dominate one of them this guy this guy is 49 hey it worked now he's on our team don't hit this dude. <laughs> what the heck? That person's dead. Fishbait Arno is on our team now. What a name. Where's he going? Wow. She really did not like Lacey. On one hit, it's pretty good. I really should just. Oh, wait, no, we couldn't have stealth, stealth through this one. I was gonna say, I was like, we always start so far away from the battle. Oh my god. 
gosh, I've heard so many trip attacks. What? What the heck? Bro, she's inflicted with like five different purple worm toxins. She just like insta dies on the next turn. And that guy just attacked like like seven times. Just fly. Not enough movement speed. Probably perfect. I kinda wanna save this lady over here. Can we even heal her? Can't throw that far. <laughs> Not even close. And fly over. And now we can try to throw a potion at her. That works. 58 HP. The fights in this game are just, they're so, I wouldn't say chaotic is the right word. I'd probably say like they're all so grand. There's a lot of, there's a lot of people in every single fight. You will do on this guy. I'm not going to use action speed. Dude, she's just throwing crap and it does like so much damage. The blade least expected. Hit a foe with whom you have advantage dealing sneak attack damage. You can just do these throw builds. My gosh, that's crazy. There's no way she ran up here just to use a range attack. Holy 
holy cow, this guy's like full-on support build. Lizelle's going to work. Making her way through. Making her way through the box. Let's go. So I have to, I have to also tell you guys that the first freaking time that I did that fight, which is why I ended up like reshooting everything, is because the first time I did that fight, um, I don't know, like I think I accidentally hit one of them or something like that, and then that caused everybody in here to attack me. Which was super frustrating. And then I found out that my last save file was all the way back in the sewer. So that reminds me, I'm gonna save right now. Yeah, my 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 closest save file was this one. Uh it was it was this one. Well, it was technically this one where we had Minsk, but we couldn't talk to Minsk because I screwed it up and I left the conversation halfway. So I had to go back and do the Minsk fight again. This was you know, 30, 30 minutes of content. No, oh, Three Piece was the only one that died. That is like such a nice quality of life. Fetcher isn't himself, so I'm running. Let's. Fetcher isn't himself, so I'm running the shop. All right, kid. Or selling. There's all the junk that we just accumulated. I wonder, does he have any potions? Nobody has thieves tools, and we need more thieves tools and potion of animal speaking. I think we're good here. I don't think I can really tell the difference. All I know is that this one gives us more armor. And I think I like that, so I, I think we're going to part with this. You know, we have no reason to because it doesn't even weigh that much. We'll just hold on to it. No time to and rest. then if we need it later, we'll put it on. There's a Giga Chad. I don't remember seeing him. Here we go. <sighs> Suppose I should have seen that coming. Zentarim aren't known for their loyalty, but I thought the bastards would keep to their contract at least. I'm too nice for my own good, I suppose. But I was in a pit, and you helped pull me out. For that, I'm grateful. You'll have what guild blades I can give when the time to take the absolute comes. So, just tell me what you need to get us there. I guess I need information. Knowing what I know usually comes at a cost. But let's say we'll put it on your tab. I'd like to know more about the guild. Thieves, frauds, and miscreants. The guild isn't any one thing. But it's not if we take a little okay, tribute so in stuff. return or tie strings of service to those we help, well. The watch, but we'll be the ones still hold. I guess this is stuff that we've already done. So that was the quest line then. Looks like we got more allies. 
So, recruit allies. Nine Fingers is grateful that we helped her retain control of the guild. She's not one to give away what's hers. We can count on her and her lady's court in the final battle. Isabel is grateful. They mail in. So we have one, two, three, four, five, six people. Holy crap. So now I have a perfect idea. In regard to getting more allies, probably we'll blow up this deal. Watch. I did want to do the I did want to do the companion quest lines. I'm pretty interested in just like boosting up the numbers of this. This just looks satisfying. We don't know where the zombies are, though. We have Mistra over there. Hmm. I think we'll go ahead and... Because the thing is, the, the reason why I'm hesitating to do the Steel Watch is that I feel like it'll progress the world, the game world, in a certain way. But maybe it won't. We'll make a save file before we do it. But we haven't really been reverting saves in a bit. Okay, so. Not like it really matters if we save. I'm interested to see how the game world changes, though. If we get rid of the steel watch early. We'll go over to the steel watch founder and blow it up. Boundary. That might be worth a night. Let's keep your hand. Sailor's key. Here's the chest. Specifically, do we get that? Looks like uh, just some random thing. See, that's honestly what I appreciate about this game a lot is that sometimes they just have some random. Whoa, whoa, mate! This is the last some place you stuff. need to be. Clear off, yeah. Uh, why can't I be here? Two words. Guild business. Only an idiot gets between them and their shipments. This is this is not even the deception. Like I'm literally part of the guild. I'm actually with the guild. I'm here to pick up that shipment. Well, I, I guess I'm technically not part of the guild, but okay, still. <laughs> Why didn't you leave with that? I trust you're going to balance the books, too, yeah? Depends. You got everything we ordered? Oh, yeah. Weapons, drugs, a bit of fire wine. You know, the usuals. Whatever. Here you go. Pleasure as always. 
Better clear it out before the fish get here. You know how they are. Who was I even talking to, bro? Big Holdo? Who's that guy? Oh. Assume nothing. Gazelle, can you loot everything, please? That's worth good money. Auto save. Go watch her here. Secure era. Area. This dock is closed until further notice by order of Lord Gortash. No one stopped me yet. Okay. With haste. I want to fight their steel watch right now. Our culprit purpose here is to destroy them. I mean, we get XP, right? And we're almost level 12, guys. What do you guys think? I mean, auto save. Why don't we just kill them? Just go in. Entrance oh. prohibited. Oh. You will not be warned again. No, we weren't even warned. We just walked in. Oh, they're weak to lightning. Oh, ho, 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 that was so satisfying. Oh my gosh, they actually do a lot of push. <laughs> Didn't kill them. Swords kill. Wait, Gale is broken by these things. No sweat. Colonel updated rescue for this victim. What? We defeated a Steel Watcher Gortash. Now, as one fear mechanical act is protecting him, investigating the Steel Watch may be a good approach. Hey, bro. We're gonna do that. Oh, 
Lovely little pick me up. What was that? Enriched infernal iron. That sounds crazy. And Tinia the Goon. Yeah, it looks like we got some stuff going on here. Oh, that. Oh, it's Bolo. <laughs> I was wondering. I was literally just wondering. I was like, man, I wonder where a Bolo is. Um. Let's continue this in the next episode. And just as a reminder, um, what I was saying earlier, I might not daily upload anymore because of the data cap on my internet provider just like i said um but we'll be back to daily uploads within 14 days or after thir after 14 days once my data cycle repeats so you know if the uploads stop happening just keep an eye out for them after the 15th november 15th that is anyway guys thank you for watching sorry for the inconvenience <laughs> If you guys enjoyed, please remember to leave a like down below. I will see you guys in the next episode, and I hope you guys have a great day.